everyone. We're going to find two numbers whose sum is 10 and the sum of their squares is a minimum. So we're going to let x and y represent the two numbers. S is the sum. So we're going to set it up and we have x plus y equals 10 and our sum equals x squared plus y squared. Or we could say that um, we let y equal 10 minus x. We could say our sum equals x squared uh, plus 10 minus x squared through substitution. Now when I clean this up, I get this is uh, x squared plus, I'm going to just fold this out, 100 minus 20x plus x squared. And you combine all this and um, put it in standard form. You get x squared, 2x squared, sorry, we have two of these, minus 20x plus 100. And again, with calculus, we want to set this to equal 0. And if you um, divide everything by 2, you get x squared minus 10x plus 50 equals 0, and this is merely x minus 5, let's see. What I can do first, I'm going to go ahead and take the derivative, do it over here, the derivative of s um, with respect to s, the derivative of s, s with respect to x equals, and I'll go ahead and use this one because it's easier, you get 2x minus 10. You set that to 0, so you get x equals um, 10 over 2, or x equals 5. So if x is 5, you plug that back in here, so you have 5 plus y equals 10, so y equals 10. Therefore, my two numbers are 5 and 5 that represent a minimum. And I also did some guidelines. No, I didn't. Well, anyway, that's all. Thank you, and have a nice day. Bye-bye.